Okay, my clock says uh, 6.30 Central Time. I'm in Nashville, Tennessee. Um, it does, I, I'm not uh, where it looks like I am. I just, that's my, that's my favorite place. That The beach is my favorite place my whole life. It's been my wife's favorite place her whole life. It's our spiritual place. Uh, so that's why I've got this backdrop. But uh, sorry about the lighting that I'm kind of washed out. So maybe just don't look at me and uh, uh, just listen. Uh, at the end, we're I'm going to try to take as much time as we need. Uh, I'm not going to say I'll stay here all night, but I'll stay here a long time to answer your questions if you have them. Uh, I'm Alex Lloyd. Uh, welcome. Uh, Laura is our uh, wonderful uh, technician behind the scenes tonight. Laura, thank you for being here, trying to make sure that I don't mess it up too bad. Um, it's, uh, it's weird to me that this day, this time, this event has arrived. Uh, we've been telling you about it um, for about two months now. Um, the serious work on belief mapping started about 14 months ago, and uh, probably all of you are aware of the results by now because they've been in all the emails. We In 14 months, it's been 14 months now, we've had four, 242 uh, people who have done belief mapping in a row without a failure. And that's, in their words, not mine. That's um, either two or three LT3 classes, and every single person in the class um, was successful. That's uh, a number of people I just worked with one-on-one, -on -one, and there's some people that I worked with in groups, and there's some people that I used early on to test this on as I was trying to figure out uh, if there was a missing piece, I thought there was, and if there was a missing piece, what that was. And it took me a few months to figure that out, then to redo it, then to start testing it again for about a year. Um, and tonight we've arrived at finally uh, the launch, uh, the official launch of, of all of this. So uh, tonight is the official launch. We've already had our first belief mapping community meeting uh, last week that went uh, really, really well, uh, better than I'd hoped. And I'll tell you more about that in a, in a few minutes. That's going to be a continuing thing with belief mapping. And we're going to build a community uh, that we hope will morph all over the world and other communities will start up as well uh, so that more and more people can be helped. Uh, please write down your questions or do the um, Q&A button at the bottom of the screen and type in your question, and we'll get to those at the end, or we'll allow you to raise your hand and ask a question directly. I think we'll be able to do that. Um, but uh, I started all of this over 30 years ago because of my wife's depression, and Going through that for 12 years, uh, Hope's depression changed both of us. Uh, it gave us, it made us care more about helping people than making money. That's probably the easiest way I can put it. And when I walked away from my private practice in uh, mainstream counseling and therapy, uh, I never, we never thought we would make that much money again. And it was a very difficult decision because I'd just been through four years of going back to graduate school, a, a one year full time uh, internship that uh, you're paid very, very little from and very, very long hours. And I did that while we had a young child and Hope was depressed both and I was working three jobs so that I could pay for school and uh, pay for, you know, uh, milk and eggs and where we were living and uh, the things that we needed and for the new baby and all of that. So when the healing codes came along, 
it was anything but an easy decision because what the uh, APA, the American Psychological Association said, is that I could not do energy medicine as part of my practice. The APA does not allow that, or they didn't then, they do now, but they didn't then because they said it's not psychology, it's not counseling. And so if you do that as part of your practice, we will sue you. And uh, a friend of mine, I, we actually work together, his name's Dr. Steve Daniels, uh, wonderful man, great practitioner, and uh, we started a company called Quantum Techniques Together that I was a part of uh, before that. And they had sued Steve and taken him to court. Now he won, he beat the APA, he beat the government, but uh, I did not want to go through that, okay? So I locked my office, went home, started the healing codes out of my basement, and um, that's our history. That was 23, 24 years ago, come this April 15th. Um, and I never imagined uh, that what has happened would happen. Uh, I hope that I could help some people and I hope that we could afford to live. But it worked so much better than the counseling. Uh, I felt really before God, like I had no choice but to... Um, stop the counseling and therapy and start the healing codes that later turned into trilogy and memory engineering and rapid eye stress release and the love code and, and those kind of things. And, um, I really, I really had thought I'm probably at about the end of, um, whatever my life's work or the healing codes or whatever. And I was fine with that. I, I, I felt good about that. Uh, we've, I've gotten to know so many wonderful people. I've, my family has seen the world. My boys grew up traveling the world with me as I did uh, workshops and lectures in, in different countries and different places. And it was really wonderful. And then belief mapping comes along. <laughs> and, and using it with the healing codes, using it with trilogy, using it with EFT, using it with the emotion code. Um, uh, Bradley Nelson is one of my best friends uh, in this field. We're probably the only two um, followers of Jesus in this field, at least that I know of. Um, and we've done joint things and uh, talk about doing more joint things. But it seems it seems like you can really almost put anything with belief mapping uh, and it works better than anything I've seen. And I know you've heard that from me before. You heard that from me about the healing codes when it uh, the heart rate variability testing showed it worked 86 to 87 percent of the time to bring your stress down by 50% or more in 30 minutes or less. And at the time, uh, based on the existing literature, that was impossible, according to the literature. Nothing could do that. It was impossible. To change your stress paradigm in 30 minutes was just unheard of then, okay? It can't happen. Well, we did it. And uh, we're doing it all the time and, and still are and still believe in that very much. Um, and then Trilogy came and on the same heart rate variability, 30 minutes or less, 50% or more, it was 98%, which I thought, you know, I, I really hesitated to even say that because I, I said people aren't going to believe me. They're going to think I'm lying or something. That's just crazy, 98% and 30 minutes or less. But using the Helium Codes or Trilogy with belief mapping works way better than either one of those or anything I've ever seen. So I kind of feel reborn. Now, I never really felt tired or old, except when I looked in the mirror. Uh, I might have felt old then. But I've really never felt tired or old, I don't think I could take a nap if, if during the day if I had to. I, I, I just can't. I just have too much energy. I, I, but I sleep like a baby at night, which is 
pretty cool. But anyway, anyway, um, so when belief mapping started working with every single person and I kept, I kept expecting really, and I shouldn't have expected, that's the Dan Gilbert stuff, expectations are a happiness killer. But uh, I think I was anyway. I kept expecting a failure. I kept expecting this can't work every time. This is this is there's got to be somebody that this doesn't work on. And I and I still believe there will be because uh, as I put in the email, my belief is the only thing that's a hundred percent is God to me. Okay, so uh, but it hasn't happened yet. All right. And uh, and with the healing codes and trilogy and memory engineering and the other things, that was never true. I never did either of those for a year or even six months without a single person. I did have people say, well, I don't feel anything. I don't think that worked for me or, or, or whatever, but not with belief mapping. And, um, and after it happened, I've really been praying and meditating. How is this even possible? How is it doing that? Because belief mapping technically isn't even an intervention. It's kind of a setup for an intervention. The way I described it in the emails is kind of like your house. It's sort of like, um, uh, uh, you know, a lot of newer houses now, they have the whole house vacuum system. So you don't have to carry around a, a vacuum. You can have one in, you know, different areas and then just plug it in and then take it to another room, plug it in there um, and clean your house. But what if there was a whole house cleaning system where you just pushed a button and you didn't even have to do the vacuuming? Somehow the house did it for you. Uh, to me, that's more like what this is, okay? Um, it goes all over your life. It goes into your childhood with your parents, with elementary school, with junior high school, with high school, even in utero when you were in your, your mother's womb, when she was pregnant with you. It goes into your 20s, 30s, 40s, 50s, 60s, 80s, whatever, and it grabs all of the dirt, all of the traumas, all of the um, negativity, all of the things that are creating stress and fear and anxiety and worry and all those things. And it brings them all together in one little bitty small place, kind of like all the dirt and garbage from your house in one garbage bag so, to, so that it's then really easy to take outside and put that in the garbage can and then the um, garbage people come and get it. Well, Belief mapping gets all of your junk into like one garbage bag. And then you use the Healing Code trilogy. And we give you that. We give you a, the, a Healing Code. We give you a trilogy you can use. You don't even have to buy those. If you want to buy them, we'll uh, one time, while you if you purchase belief mapping, we'll let you buy any of those at 50% off, which we've never done and never intend to do again. But we did want to give you, if you wanted more codes or tr trilogies to give you a really reasonable um, reasonable financially, uh, a way to do that. So um, you can do that, but we will give you a healing code and trilogy with belief mapping that you can use on any issue, any trauma, anything in your life, okay? Um, Laura, if you could put up the uh, 10 switches, please. And, and then after that, the 12 systems. When I was developing belief mapping, uh, this is what I was trying to, this is what I was trying to do, okay? I was trying to do something that would activate these 10 things that I had researched because I believed if all 10 of these could be activated for healing, for love, joy, peace, for truth, that it could heal just about anything. It could change just about anything. And I'm gonna go through those really fast. Uh, right brain and left brain, all right? 
And we could probably stop there. And it would be incredibly effective if it just did those two. Right brain is, at, is out of the box thinking. It's, it's, uh, it's uh, wisdom. It's, um, um, it's new thinking. It's how can we make this happen? Left brain is linear, but it's also detailed. Right brain is more broad strokes in general, okay? But they work together in perfect harmony. Uh, a macro focus of your problems. Macro means big, huge general focus. So in other words, by looking by one glance at one page, you can see your problem in its totality in a, in a general way. But then also in one glance, you can see all the tiny little details of your issue, both with one glance. It has to include ancestry and relationship because every issue boils down to a relationship issue because the hypothalamus in your brain is what determines stress or no stress and the way it determines that is a love-based signal or a fear-based signal where there is no love outside the context of relationship. It does not exist. And fear happens when there's an absence of love. So both of those are relationship-based. Laura, if you could go to the next page, please. So those are the first five. And then you have unconscious mind, subconscious mind, conscious mind, will, and emotions. In other words, your entire total mind, every thought, every emotion, every belief, every trauma, things passed down from your ancestors that you don't even know you have. This brings them all together in one garbage bag, and then the codes take them to the garbage can, out of your house, out of your body and mind, forever. And then the last, the last two may be the two most important. Conscious conflict is a silent killer. It's basically when you're violating your own belief system in some way, okay? And um, um, conscious conflict will keep you stuck even if you don't know you are violating your own belief system. You can be doing that unconsciously. Well, we're going to make sure that's not an issue that's holding you back. And when you heal conscious conflict, start living what you believe, things start flowing and usually don't get stuck again unless you start violating your belief system again. Uh, and then the last one is Delta Theta memories, which I call popsicle memories because of a client I had. These are programmed into you as major traumas but they're not major traumas. In fact, if a psychologist or psychiatrist looked at that memory, they would say, well, that's not it. There's no problem there. When in reality, that may be what is causing your illness or disease or, or blocking your health. Uh, one more note, on conscious conflict, every habit and addiction, every would fall under conscious conflict. And I've never met a person who didn't have a negative habit or addiction. This is the best solution I've ever seen. Um, okay, now, Laura, if you would bring out the 12 body systems, the 12 systems in us that those 10 affect your nervous system, brain functioning, the stress response. Are you in anxiety, peace, or neutral? Positive versus negative signals in your mind and emotion. That's different from just memories, thoughts, or feelings, those signals. Uh, all kinds of automatic things happen inside you based on positive or negative signals from your brain and nervous system. Believing the truth or falsehood can make the difference in any issue. Fear versus love is the difference in any issue. Your blood sugar and blood pressure, both of those are huge. Uh, immune system functioning. Um, is anything a lot more important than that? I mean, without that, you're dead. 
Uh, I've asked over 100 medical doctors. I haven't done it lately, but I, I did it a lot for the first 10 years of the healing codes. Um, if your immune system is working the way it's supposed to, can you get a serious disease? And knock on wood, so far, every medical doctor I've asked that question, including yesterday, my medical doctor, because I had a checkup, has said no. If your immune system is working the way it's supposed to, you cannot get a serious disease. Your glandular hormonal balance. And uh, a, a lot of you probably heard me say, I've asked a lot of medical doctors, how important is your glandular hormonal system? It, and, and what I've gotten is brain and nervous system, most medical doctors consider most important, but glandular hormonal is second. And a lot of medical doctors have told me they would put glandular hormonal kind of 1A or 1B with your brain and nervous system because it is so crucial those hormones, whether whether uh, cortisol or oxytocin, I mean, that is a, a, a day-changing difference. If you've got oxytocin dripping from your brain, you're in love, joy, peace, positivity, happy, great relationships, your immune system is functioning like it's supposed to, et cetera. OK, if you've got cortisol dripping, you go up for about five minutes with massive energy. Then you go into cortisol crash if there's not a real trauma or emergency, if you don't have to run or fight to save your life. OK, and 99% and of the time, that's what's going on. It's not a real life changing, um, life uh, threatening emergency. It's some memory with anger in it that's being reactivated by something. And that anger may not even be yours. It might have been your grandmother's, okay? So this can take care of that stuff kind of automatically. It can go grab it without you having to find every little piece and search for a long, long time. Uh, identity and worth feelings. I keep saying this as I go through the list, but... Is there a whole lot more important than that? Everything you do, everything you think, every emotion and feeling you have, the source of it is your identity and worth in your memory banks and your brain and nervous system. As your identity and worth goes, you go. Um, this one actually isn't nearly as important, your actions and behaviors. It's not that important because that one takes care of itself. If the underlying is positive, your actions and behaviors are likely to be positive. If, if, um, if the underlying is, is negative, your actions and behaviors are likely to be habits, addictions, and negative, okay? Uh, and then the last one is uh, my friend, Dr. Bruce Lipton's, one of his biggest points of our entire health paradigm, your basic cell health. Every cell you have is either in growth mode or in stress mode at any given time. And which mode it's in determines everything. What it does, what it doesn't do, whether it takes in nutrition, whether it gets rid of toxins, whether it does its job or turns into a cancer cell, okay? That's all determined by basic cell health, open or closed, in growth mode or self-protect. And Belief mapping and those 10 switches activate all of these at the same time. And, the, and, and I believe that's why we're seeing these kind of results that I've never seen with anything before. Okay. Um, all right, Laura, you can take that down. Okay. So um, you, if you've read any of the emails or, or the landing page of belief mapping, you kind of know the history that I started it over 30 years ago. I thought it would work every time. It did not work every time. And I sort of put it on the shelf, even though I've continued to use it until about 14 months ago 
when it started bugging me again and I decided I must be missing something and went back to try and see what I was missing. That's the history. And then the more current history, I, I told you when we started tonight, um, there's three there's three ways you can do belief mapping. There's three levels of belief mapping. Laura, don't pull that up just yet, but maybe have it ready. Um, let me let me kind of share with you what they are before you uh, look at that page. There's level one, two, and three. Level one is just the home study program. And it comes with the belief mapping basic and the belief mapping advanced, both. Okay. It also comes with other programs like the seven uh, steps to guaranteed success and several others that I'll show you in a minute. Okay. And um, it has everything you need. It has uh, videos, manuals, um, everything, everything you need for your whole family, not just you, your whole family, start to finish, A to Z. And again, we give you the healing code and trilogy to, trilogy to use with that for any and every issue, any and every belief mapping you could ever want or need to do. All of that is included. That's level one. Level two is the same as level one, except you get a certified belief mapping life coach for two months. Um, and uh, we've been saying that that would be four sessions with the coach over those two months, one about every other week, which is what we figured out is best, is every other week. Uh, that gives you time to do it. Um, it. There's less pressure. It just works better than every week. Um, I'm going to announce tonight that if you sign up for level two tonight or in the next week, we're going to give you a fifth one-on-one -on -one session with a coach for free at no additional charge. And that's whether you're working with a certified uh, belief mapping life coach or me, either one, uh, you're going to get five one-on-one -on -one sessions instead of four. So level two is the same as level one with the one-on-one -on -one certified coach. Level three is the same as level one, except I'm your coach for five sessions over the next two months. And with level three, we're going to do an all-day, all-issues belief mapping workshop next Friday next Friday, all day long, okay? We're going to work on every issue you have in your life on that day with Belief Mapping, the Healing Codes, and Trilogy. It is a hands-on healing workshop day. It is not me teaching or talking. It is hands-on work all day long, and we will do custom belief mapping and custom healing codes and trilogies for every issue of your life. And we will give you the custom codes to take with you from that workshop to use with belief mapping for every issue for the rest of your life. Okay? And you get the five one-on-one -on -one sessions with me. Okay? So that's level three. All right. Now, Laura, if you could put that slide up so they could see that, please. Okay, here are, here's what you get. And the one on the far left is level one. The middle is level two with a certified coach. On the far right is level three with me. So you get the greatest principle teaching, which um, is basically the love code. Um, I've always called it the greatest principle, but my publisher did not like that name. So we called it the love code. It is, it is the best thing I have ever heard. It is the best way to live I have ever found. I have never seen it not work with someone who committed and lived that way. And this will show you how, and you can now use the belief mapping to put that into practice, to make the greatest principle work 
in your life. So you get that, you get the um, the belief mapping videos, the manuals, uh, you get, and, and this says wheels. You're wondering what in the world is a wheel? You'll, if you buy belief mapping, you'll know what a, wheel, what a belief mapping wheel is. That is part of the secret, all right? Every time we work on something, it's in a wheel, all right? And it's, it's, it's a big part of why it works so well, okay? Um, there's also, uh, as most of you know, I'm a follower of Jesus. It's the most important thing in my life. I'm not here to push that on you or to try to convince you of that. But a lot of our uh, people are do believe in Jesus. So if that is true, you will also receive the belief mapping for believers, um, basic and advanced. All right? You'll receive the family-to-family -family program that we have sold for years for I don't remember how much we've sold it for. I think it was $200 or something like that. Um, and people rave about that. We have a lot of people that the family to family program is the only way they work on their issues. Okay. Um, and it is, it is very extensive. It's, it's, uh, it's a big deal. It goes through all of the virtues, all of the vices, um, everything, all right? Uh, there's the seven steps to guaranteed success. There's, um, ah, then the community. All right. For the first time ever, we are trying to start a healing community, a hands-on healing community. Not, not to come and listen to me do a teaching about some spiritual truth. No, that is not what this is, okay? This is, a, this is a healing community. We're meeting the first and third uh, weeks of each month, and it'll be about an hour to an hour and a half. Every single meeting will be hands-on healing with custom codes, custom trilogy, and belief mapping. And once a month, we will introduce a brand new wheel for a different issue. I think the first one we're going to do maybe next week will be for anxiety, and the whole wheel will be about nothing but anxiety, but all aspects of anxiety, so you can heal it completely. Uh, the, the second one will probably be cancer, and it'll be all aspects of cancer and custom codes for that, so you can hopefully heal the source of that cancer very quickly, all right? So we're going to meet twice a month, for an hour to an hour and a half each meeting. Each meeting will have new custom healing procedures. Once a month, we'll have a completely new healing paradigm, and we're going to build a complete library of these, okay? Anxiety, depression, bipolar, um, uh, PTSD, obsessive compulsive, uh, blood sugar issues, ALS, Alzheimer's, Parkinson's, the flu, um, everything, uh, everything. And we're going to keep developing new ones, new custom interventions for each of those. And you will have access to all of those, not only for yourself, but your, for your family for as long as you choose to stay in the community with, with, with the level one belief mapping, you get two months of the community for free. Uh, it's a $200 a month value, and that's being very conservative. Probably more like four or $500 a month in the, in the, is more market value right now. Those things have gone way up since um, COVID, okay? Um, so with level one, you get two months free. With level two, you get four months free with the certified coach. If you work with me, you get six months free. Now, after that free period is over, how much is it going to cost? $200? $100 half price? How about 75% off $50? No, $30. That, at least for the time being, it's going to be $30 a month for those communities, okay? 
And um, let me tell you, you Google and you see if you can find anything like that. And if you do, I'm betting you it's going to be $100, $200, $300, $500 a month, not $30 a month. But you get it for free at first, all right? And I believe that is the difference in the three levels, all right? Um, okay. Now, the one thing you need to be aware of is the all-day comprehensive for all life issues, all custom codes, all custom belief mappings. That is next Friday. Now, you don't have to be there. We'll record the whole thing. We'll post it, and it will work just as well for you later as it will if you're there on Friday. I know a lot of people have conflicts on Friday. By the way, the reason we're doing it on Friday is since COVID, the stats say that the time most people prefer to do things like this now is not on the weekend and it's not at night. It's during the day, during the week. So that's why we're doing it. We never would have done that before COVID. It would have been on the weekend or at night. But what, they're, what the, the data says today is it works better this way. But if you have a conflict, you will not miss a thing. Everything will be available to you, and it will work just as well as if you were there. And if you have questions from the workshop uh, after the fact, you can still get those answered. It's not like if you're not at the workshop, you can't get your questions answered. We'll still get those answered for you. You can just email us or, or whatever. All right. So, Laura, you can take that down. All right. So let's uh, open it up for questions and answers. I think that's um, I think that's about all I wanted to say for the overview. I will say this though, uh, and I've said this in some of the emails as well. If you've been around us for a while, you're probably aware we will we will come out with a new product, we'll launch it, and then it'll remain available. But we really don't keep talking about it a lot. That's not going to be the case with belief mapping. Everything we do from now on is going to include belief mapping. Why? Because I'm not insane. <laughs> That's the only way I know to put it. You know, the definition of insanity is doing the same thing over and over and over, expecting different results. Well, we're not doing the same thing over and over. We found something that works better, and we're going to do it. And let, let me address one other thing here with that. I know, I know times are very hard right now. The economy is really struggling. Lots of people are living paycheck to paycheck. Um, some people are having the hardest financial times of their entire life right now, okay? I understand that uh, very, very well. If you, if you need help, if you, can, if you are financially impoverished and you honestly can't afford this, we will help you, I promise. In 23 years, we've never turned one person away because of money, okay? And But where I was going is, I know some people, that ups, they get upset at that. They think, well, wait a minute. I just got, I just got the Trilogy Wellbeing Program that came out in August, and now you're telling me I need this? Well, I'm never going to apologize for that, okay? I'm not going to live by the definition of insanity. I'm not just going to keep doing the same thing because I'm, it's comfortable or easy or whatever. If I find something tomorrow that works better than belief mapping, you better believe I'm going to tell you about it. All right? So in one sense, I apologize that when the Healing Codes came out 23 years ago, I said, this is the best thing I've ever seen. And according to the literature, it's impossible. When Trilogy came out, I said the same thing. And now I'm saying it with belief mapping. But ladies and gentlemen, it's the truth in all three cases, okay? Google that stuff for yourself. And if something comes out better tomorrow, you'll be hearing about that. But I doubt it. I really believe this is the top of my ladder. 
I really do. I've, I, I've talked to several of my peers like Brad Nelson uh, in the last year. And what I'm hearing from my peers about belief mapping is they've never seen anything like it either. Okay. And I'm even talking to some of them about them using it with their intervention because it makes their intervention work so much better. Okay. So I didn't want to add that. So, um, uh, Laura, let's open it up for Q and A, and I'm gonna I'm gonna read the typed ones at the bottom, and then if we need to let people raise their hand, that's fine too. Okay. So, um, first question: um, When doing the rapid eye movement portion, that's a that's a that's not a belief mapping question. That's either a rapid eye stress release or a trilogy question. But the answer, the answer, Jessica, is it doesn't matter. Doesn't matter. Um, let's see. Next question. Um, I watched the first community meeting and and did the healing sequence uh, from that. Um, let's see. Should I be doing it daily? Yes, you should. Or should I wait until I have my first one-on-one -on -one with a coach? No, do the one from the community daily. And then when you meet with the coach, uh, if it changes then, then switch to that. But keep doing that. All right, um, another question. What do we write down? You will know when you get the program. Okay, if I told you what you will write down, I would be giving it away, and I'm not going to do that, all right? Um, do we just compare the numbers? No, no, I'll, I'll, Donald, all of that is made A, B, C, 1 plus 1 equals 2 clear in the program, and it is simple, okay? Uh, we, we've had 10-year-olds do belief mapping on their own, on their own, okay? and have great results. All right, let's see. Um, Don, I've not explained how to do the process. I've just explained what it does and kind of what's behind it. Okay. Um, Jamie, this is the same thing. Jamie asked a question and this is it. Oh, this is more developed. There's a lot more to it. The advanced you don't have, but the basic is the same, Jamie. All right. Um, here's a comment. Belief mapping removes the confusion caused by interactions with other people. It's the ultimate freedom. It's by someone who's obviously already been doing it. Um, is belief mapping one accessible with the monthly $50 membership? It's not 50, it's free at first, and then after the free, it's 30, not 50. But the answer, Jeff, is no. You have to be a part of belief mapping to come to the community meetings, all right? All right. Um, and then someone else asked a question about rating, and, and I'm not gonna answer that because that is, again, how to do belief mapping. That's not the purpose of this event. The purpose of this event is what, what is it? How does it work? Um, what can you expect? Not how can you do it without buying it? We have to, we have to eat and, and buy bread and milk too, okay? Um, have you worked with people with autism or cerebral palsy? Not with belief mapping. Uh, we have with the codes and had good results. I, I would expect improvement at least, but no, we have not done it with that. Um, someone asked, can we have a demonstration of doing belief mapping? No, again, that's not the purpose of this call, uh, but you have a 365 day money back guarantee for any reason, no questions asked, okay? If, if it doesn't work for you or you get it and say, this is just not for me, we've not had anyone, anyone say that, by the way. But if you say that, no problem. All your money back. Um, there is no contact button to ask a question. Um, 
to ask to if you want to ask a question, you go to um, support at the healingcodes.com or contact at the healingcodes.com. Uh, send it to one of those or both. If you just go to our main website, dralexanderloyd.com, scroll down to the bottom where it says contact us. Just click on that and then type a message and we will respond. Um, someone says, I could not find a link to the first community meeting. Uh, if you'll contact us, we'll make sure to get that to you. The only people that was sent to are people who have purchased belief mapping and all of you have access to it at any time. Um, okay. Is the true you test included with belief mapping? No, two true you tests are included with belief mapping. They're a hundred dollars each. We're giving you two of them for free when you buy belief mapping. No extra charge. We want you to do one before you start and once probably at about two months to see your progress. Okay? That's all the written questions, at least all the ones I can answer right now. Um, Laura, do we want to let people raise their hand? Can you tell them how to do that? Or do we want to do that? Yes, you can press a star nine on your phone. Star nine if you want to raise your hand and ask a question live. Or make a comment. We'll give you a couple of minutes there to do that. While we're waiting, I know myself pretty well. And, and a lot of that is because I'm married to this beautiful, wonderful woman called Hope. And uh, she makes sure that I know myself pretty well. Um, and I'm very grateful for that. I know I'm the Energizer Bunny. I know I'm passionate. I know to some people I sound like a used car salesman. Okay. I know that. I've, I've had that all my life. Okay. And, um, and I know that's true with this as well. But what I'll tell you again is I've been in this field and doing this stuff for over 30 years now, and I've never remotely seen anything that works like this. Johanna Chan is the head of our coaching program. A lot of you, excuse me, probably either know her or have heard her name. And um, she emailed me one day and, um, and said, boy, this belief mapping really works. And then she went on to tell me about what had just happened with a client of hers uh, that was just amazing. Uh, and, and I've heard that from many of our coaches. And, and let me tell you, some of them are not that easily impressed They've been doing high-level work for years and years and years. It takes a lot to impress some of them, and they are blown away by this. I have practitioners coming out of the woodwork that have nothing to do with the healing codes. How can I learn belief mapping? How can I do belief mapping with my clients, with my patients, with my, you know, um, once, once they try it for themselves and see how it works? Jeff. You are unmuted, Jeff Johnson, if you would like to say something. At least I think you're unmuted. Hi, Dr. Alex. Hey, Jeff. Um, How you doing? Uh, thank you. I appreciate you. Um, I, was, I was just wondering about the, um, the Access Plus subscription. I, it was just uh, I found on your website. Is, is that, does that include uh, the belief mapping, or is that a totally just include different things? It does I, not I didn't include... See it. I, I, I'm not sure, actually, Jeff. Um, if you would, if you would email that in, and 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 I know that sounds ridiculous because this is my company, but years ago I realized that um, if I kept my eyes on money or numbers, it got me off track. 
it it totally ripped me away from the spiritual and and I wasn't in the place I wanted to be to work with people and help people. So years ago, I quit looking at numbers and money and I told people that work with me, I would like for you to handle that and I'm not even going to ask. Just just tell me if there's some sort of problem or something. So I know it sounds crazy, Jeff, but I have nothing to do with that part of what we do. And, and uh, the people that do aren't on this call. So if you would email us at either support or contact at thehealingcodes.com, we'll find the answer to that and let you know quickly. But I honestly don't know. I'm sorry. Thanks so much. I appreciate that. Oh, you're welcome. You're very welcome. Thank you. All right, anyone else want to ask a live question? We've got a lot of people here. Anyone else want to ask a live? Uh, Mari, go right ahead. Okay. Uh, my question is, how do we get in touch with our personal coach? I bought a level two. Uh, they have been in touch with you. They have already sent emails. So if you have not, if, if you've not been in touch with your coach, you need to check your spam file because the day you purchased, you received a letter from the coach. So go check your spam. And if there's nothing there, um, you need to contact our, our customer support and they will put you in direct contact with the coach themselves to make sure you connect. But you have been sent an email, everyone has, who is, who is purchased. And, and many of them are already working with their coach. So um, I believe it's probably in your spam folder or something like that, or there's some technical glitch, but you can completely clear that up tomorrow. Those coaches are ready. They're available. They're waiting. They're already working with people. So contact where, us and we will where, get you. Where do, I, where do I send the contact um for it. It's not in my spam. I've already checked. Okay, then go to, uh, it, it's either contact at thehealingcodes.com or support at thehealingcodes.com. Oh. Laura, okay. do you know which? I did get a letter from your son, an email, that I didn't ah, understand that's it. it to be a that's coach. That's it. He's your coach. Yes. So that was it? Yes, that's it. Oh, okay. That's it. Thank you. Yes. He's 30 years old. He's a certified Coach, he knows this stuff better than anyone. He knows it better than me. We've been <laughs> talking about this stuff since he was four years old. Really, seriously, that's not a that's oh, not okay. a. Okay. Um, Thank you. Oh, you're very welcome. All right. Anyone else? All right. I guess that's it, and that's great. So, because the last time we went overtime, and now we're a few minutes early. Um, all I can say is um, I know 500 bucks is a lot of money, especially these days. But there's a 365 day for any reason, money back guarantee. Let me tell you, if you're struggling with a health issue, whether physical or emotional, goodness gracious, if you don't have your health, you know the old expression, if you don't have your health, you don't have anything, okay? Um, if you need, if you absolutely are impoverished and, and cannot afford it, contact us and I promise we will help you. I promise we will. That is not like some of these pharmaceutical companies who say that and then and they'll help, you know, one person in a hundred that apply. No, 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 no. We, if you need help, we will not turn you away for any reason. And if, and if, for any reason it doesn't work for you or you think it's not for me, we, get, we will give you your money back immediately. No questions asked. We'll smile doing it, okay? But please don't get 5, 10, 20 years down the road and say, I wish I'd tried that. That's the thing that would be a tragedy to me because I believe with all my heart that you will, that with 242 in a row, you will not be the one that it doesn't work on. Now, is that possible? Yes, of course. Only God's 100%, but I doubt it. And if it, and if it does happen, 
all your items time because we'll give you all your money back. So um, that that's about all I can do is uh, we've done the work. I've, done, I, I've literally been working and testing belief mapping for 44 years. That's when I started it. When I, when I first developed the basic belief mapping, 44 years, and we are just now launching it, okay? So um, I would say that's probably long enough for us to know it works. And of course, uh, if you've been around us, you know there have been 23 double-blind studies at major universities published in peer-reviewed journals in the United States, Europe, and Asia that say that the Healing Codes and Trilogy work on 80 some odd life issues. They've never done a study that found it didn't work. And that's what you're gonna use. And we'll give you a, the Healing Code and Trilogy to use with belief mapping. You don't have to buy that, it's included. If you want other stuff, you can get it for half price this one time when you purchase. And then the communities will be doing hands-on work every single time together to heal these issues, which is much more powerful than doing it on your own. So um, thank you so much for being here. Thank you for your interest, regardless of, uh, of, of whether you decide to do it or not. God bless you. Oh, we have one more question. Oh, no, no, we already answered that. Sorry. So um, thank you so much for your time. God bless you. Have a wonderful evening. And I hope to see you at the at the workshop next Friday. And I hope to see, I believe, I believe next Friday at that live workshop, lives are going to be changed forever. Not starting that day, on that day. By the end of that day, I believe lives are going to be changed forever. We're going to work on every issue you have that day together. Okay? So I hope to see you there. And I hope to see you at the communities every first and third week of the month. Thank you so very much. Have a wonderful day. Laura, love you. Thank you so much. God bless you, everyone.